from Farzam. Um, question is about the explanation of the alpha, beta, and gamma rays. Are there plasma, any of the elements in a special condition can release one of them or not? Uh, I guess, uh, is, Every... can the plasma of an element release one of them is what you say? Every element we have releases full spectrum of the radiations in the universe. From hydrogen to plutonium and above. It's just that you have to get it in the condition which it releases it. If you go back to the space reactors of the Keshe Foundation, which we tested and it's in the patterns, we create ionization, what we call centralization, through the interaction of the helium. We, we can produce X-ray from water. And we can produce gamma rays and cosmic rays from hydrogen. Not through you. I can get gold to produce so much radioactive material that you don't want to get near it. This is uh, this is what we tested in the space reactors in Iran. This is how I handle high bridge nuclear material by hand. I know how to deactivate them through my blood circulation and through the fields I create. Every element has the capability, and not the capability, actually does release a full spectrum of after all the fields, radiations of the universe. It's not just because you see water as a water. Sometimes the water you touch as a water you drink is the most lethal uh, weapon in another part of the universe because it releases radioactive material radiation. It is what we perceive through the lack of knowledge today. Always said, if you ever get to see in the Iran senior scientists who were monitoring my work in Tehran, I never wear gloves, I never have a fear of handling nuclear material. I learned at a very early stage, in very young age, how these things are created and how I can change it. When you open an x ray tube, you see it if you look for it. You change the plate angle slightly, you get nothing. You change it different. Even in a specific way, you release gamma rays and all sorts of cosmic rays from an X-ray tube. My father used to tell me, you're crazy, why you do this? I said, I have to understand. Every element has a potential to release full spectrum of the field, from hydrogen to plutonium, and all the isotopes, and other materials, or the interaction of certain materials against each other. It's beautiful if mankind come to understand the beauty of the radiations, how to manipulate them to create fountains of life, Uh, so our scientists have a fear of unknown, they call them all sorts of things, but there's a beauty in gamma rays and x-rays and cosmic rays. And if you know how to produce it, that allows you to create the next stage for production of the fields you want, gravitational, magnetical, and the rest of it. A master in playing fields, creating fields and targeting what fields I want to create.
So don't ever be afraid of uh, radiation. Understand how to manipulate it. Radiations are like uh, jigsaw puzzles you put together. If you get a gamma ray targeting the field of alpha, ah, you see the most beautiful things in the universe. If you get a cosmic rays interacting with uh, beta rays, oh, oh, you see some of the most beautiful fountains of energy ever seen in the universe. We see these in the structure of the planetary systems or the stars or galaxies, but we don't understand how these fountains of energy come. They are majority from radioactive material or radi radiation, what we call it. We only guess Alpha, Beta, and Gamma, there are millions of them. And the interaction releases fountains of uh, energies we see in the universe. I remember when I was very young, opening the first uh, X-ray tubes, and my father used to go nuts. You don't touch this, these are contaminated. I said, they're contaminated to you because you don't know how to handle it. I know what I'm doing. And sometimes he used to sit and watch me baffled. A nine-year-old, ten-year-old boy plays with these tubes, with the X-ray machines. They open it, the liquids in it, the oils in it, all sorts of commotion if you ever open the X-ray tube. The mirrors, the reflectors, the cardinals, but, but in fact, you can just tilt some things and you go from alpha to gamma and beta and go to cosmic rays in the same tube. 